Brothers and sisters, please give the drill team another round yeah. of applause. change in the schedule to accommodate brother Victor Manuel Lamagna's presentation. Victor is the first trade union leader of Cuba to be allowed to travel in the United States and tour in the last 20 years. He is the Secretary General of the Hotel and Tourism Union. He has served since 2011. He's the leader of the nationwide committee member of the Central Workers Union, the CTC. He's also a delegate to the Cuba's National Assembly, the Parliament. Very quickly for our young members, it's important for you to know that our association with Cuba goes back to 1947. There was an international sugar committee that was organized for the purpose of dealing with the sugar cartel. Brother Louis Goldblatt, our international secretary treasurer, was the chairman. The vice chairman was Jesus Menendez, Cuban, who was head of the Sugar Workers Union. Over the years, ILWU has had solidarity with workers going to visit. We have been out front on the question of ending the embargo. And just for your information, it's important for you to know that the cities of Sacramento, the cities of Richmond, the cities of Oakland, the cities of Berkeley have passed resolutions calling for the end to the embargo. At this juncture, because I got a three hour I got a three hour speech and two minutes to say it, so I'm wrapping up. I want to bring Brother Victor. Please give him a wonderful round of applause. Queridas hermanas y hermanos. Un saludo caluroso del pueblo y trabajadores cubanos. Thank you, brothers and sisters. Please receive a very warm greeting from the people and the workers of Cuba. participar en este importante acto del jueves sangriento. I have the honor and the privilege of being able to participate in this such an important act of Bloody Thursday. Acto de solidaridad, espacio de reflexión, intercambio y debate sobre las complejas realidades del mundo contemporáneo. It's a very important act of solidarity, a space of reflection, exchange and debate regarding the complex realities that today's world we are living in. Yes, it is. Y el aporte práctico a su necesaria transformación de la solidaridad militante comprometida y revolucionaria. And the practical contributions towards the necessary transformation um, towards a militant solidarity that is committed revolutionary that is developing between